So has added another feather in its cap. India's space agency conducted the first test flight of Gaganyaan at Satish Dhawan Space Zero. Center in Sri Harikota. The test flight involved a specially designed single-stage rocket that launched the crew escape system and the crew model simultaneously. ISRO conducted the test for flight demonstration and evaluation of test vehicle subsystems. Gaganyaan project is going to demonstrate human space flight capability by taking a three-member crew to an orbit of 400 kilometers on a mission that's going to last three days and then bring the crew back safely with the landing set to take place in the Indian sea waters. I'm very happy to announce the successful accomplishment of the TVD1 mission. The purpose of this mission was to demonstrate the crew escape system for the Gaganyan program through a test vehicle demonstration in which the vehicle has gone up to a uh, Mach number which is a speed of sound slightly above that and initiated a, an abort condition for the crew escape system to function. Uh, it uh, took the crew escape system, took the crew module away from the vehicle and uh, subsequent operations to the crew module separation from the crew escape system, all the parachutes opening and touched down on in the sea at the required velocity has been very well accomplished and we have got confirmation of the data of all of this. Sir, this is like, you know, uh, never before attempt. It's a bucket of uh, three experiments put together and we have now seen the fragrance and the, uh, the characteristics of all three systems with what we wanted to test through this experiment or this mission. The test vehicle, the crew escape system, the crew module, everything, I think we have uh, like, you know, perfectly demonstrated in the very first attempt but for the initial hitch, but that's nothing of a problem at all. All the systems performed well. Our astronauts will not be able to do their job. They will be able to do their job. And when they are able to get out of the water, they will be able to get out of the water. After that, they will come to the next year, in 2025. I think that now the situation is coming. It is proven that the world is going to be able to get out of the world. Our entry is going to be able to get out of the world. If you look at it, you will be able to get out of the Soviet Union or America. But today we are in the situation that we have to get out of the world, we have to get out of the world. Nothing is lost because uh, such uh, things do happen. Uh, before the launch, if an uh, uh, anomaly is observed, it is better to hold and save the mission rather than attempting an uh, adventurous uh, launch uh, with a defective part or defective system. There will be a number of tests, hmm. though they have stated that uh, 20, uh, 20 tests, uh, we can go a long way. And uh, depends on the success of one test, uh, then you will be either skipping a test or. Uh, but I don't think they will skip any test because they will be extra careful in uh, ensuring as well as in making sure that the whole thing goes well. Because they are going to play with the human life there. Mm -hmm. So that's the whole thing. Now I think it is yet to touch down. Now it is nearing probably touching down. I'm happy.